Hello, I'm Aaron, and I'm Josh, and as you've probably seen, or hopefully seen, we've been reviewing giant creature films, snakes, crocodiles, sharks, you name it, we sort of try to review it. Um, today we're doing something slightly different, we've decided to look at some Asian films. Um, today we're going to be reviewing Visitor Q by Takashi Mikai. Um, where to start? Yeah, um... Okay, first of all, don't be put off by the film quality. It does look as it does it doesn't look as professional. Like just the quality of like the film I can't remember what is the reasons behind it, but it was a TV film. It it was made as part of a series for Japanese uh, some Japanese channel um and each of the directors were given as far as I know, the task of making a film to do with sex, essentially, um, and this was Takashi Mikai's. Um, Naturally, being a slightly off kilter, he decided to uh, do a even odder film than usual. Um, he's best known for his films like Audition, Dead or Alive, Gozu. Generally, quite weird films. Um, this, by far, is the weirdest of all of his films I've seen. Um, yeah, same for me. That does that is probably is probably the weirdest, most off the wall sort of. Um, the basic plot of it: um, a family is essentially having sort of usual family problems, but to the extreme. Um, like you've got the younger boys all constantly being bullied. Um, beats his mother and stuff. And yeah, yeah, the parents are falling out, possibly going for divorce. The girl, the young girl, the daughter's into like prostitution. Yeah, as, essentially they've all got their problems. Um, and it's like a sort of yes, yeah, it's, it's like family problems, but emphasised to like the max. Um, sure. Yeah, um, and one day they meet this visitor cue of the title, um, and he comes into their household and essentially. Um, tries to make the problems go away in the weirdest possible ways. I wouldn't really say that there's a plot to the film. I think that is the plot. Well, that is actually the plot. Technically, yeah, but just the way the actual film pans out, okay. I would say that it's more sort of so that just events happen and the visitor is the only real recurring element. Yeah, um it's just quite a sweet story about how this family learned to effectively be a family again. I wouldn't go with sweet person. Okay, okay, sweet was the wrong word. Um, Twisted and sick would possibly be the right word. Well, I, I, it's weird because he takes sexual taboos and perversities, shows them to almost one of the extremes, but it sort of does work. It never feels there for the sake of being there, it's all there because it is sort of needed, um, but it's not really for one of, it's not really for someone who doesn't like violence or sex. Extreme, extreme sex on that one. Yeah. Um, all of which are probably the highlights of the films, I'd say. It, Just the pure shock factor of some of them. It, it, Without spoiling anything, it does feature things like lactation, necrophilia, um, it's a good film, though. incest. Yeah, incest. <laughs> yeah, um, it's. But the pro The thing is, every part of me wants to say I hate this film on principle, but I don't. It it's a good little film. It does exactly what it sets out to do. And it it works. Yeah, it's enjoyable. I'd watch it again. Wouldn't really go with enjoyable, but <laughs> I, it, it's interesting. It's yeah, interesting. It's an interesting study on sort of life, really. But yeah, I, I'd say it's well worth picking up if you can still get hold of it. Not his best film, but always worth a look.
Yeah, um, it's also worth the note that um, it was released on Titan Asia Extreme. Um, Titan were bought out by a company called Parasades. Palisades, yeah. Palisades. Um, and they haven't yet re-released it as far as I know. Um, they're working through the back catalogue and re-releasing all the old films. Don't know if this will get released. Um, you can still pick it up under the Titan Asia Extreme label at the moment, but I don't know how long. I'd say it's well worth picking up um, while you can. Um, and yeah, watch it. it. Right. Right.